Toastmasters, welcome guests. Why does a millennial like me join Toastmasters? You don't see too many of us in this room. Why not? Is it that 20-somethings cannot benefit from Toastmasters as much as someone who's older? I don't think so. Is the Toastmasters club a more well-known club among the older demographic and maybe just not as prevalent in millennial social circles? Well, maybe. I do not know why there are not more millennials in this room, but I will tell you why I am. In my few years in the real world, I came to the realization of how important it is to be able to represent yourself in front of a group and express yourself articulately. I was able to see that having this ability would be extremely beneficial in life and especially throughout my career. I thought of a simple job interview example. Now the purpose, from the hiring perspective, the purpose of interviewing is to fill the position with the most qualified candidate. However, I figured out a flaw in the hiring, in the interview process. Say a company was interviewing to fill a position and that they narrowed it down to two candidates, me and someone else. Now for the purpose of the example, let's say the other person is a male. We were both equally qualified for the position, but he was a better communicator. Who would get the job? The other candidate would be chosen because he'd be better able to promote himself and express his value to the company during the interview process. Next, I ran a scenario again. Everything exactly the same, except this time I put myself as just slightly more qualified than the other candidate. Now in the second scenario, you would think that I'd be the person to automatically get the job because I was more qualified. But no, it is still likely that the other person would get the job simply because he was a more effective communicator than I. The other candidate is able to hack the interview process by seeming to be more appealing to the employer. I did not want to be on the losing end in this scenario. My career, such an important priority in my life, and something I've been working toward for many years could be dramatically accelerated if I was just able to improve my speaking. It clicked. I realized that this is one of the most important skills that a person can have. My interest was piqued, and I made it a mandate to improve. I first heard about Toastmasters from one of my college professors. He mentioned that there's a club called Toastmasters where you could practice your public speaking. Sitting in class, I thought about what Toastmasters would be like. I imagined going to my first meeting presenting in a lecture hall with 100 people and speaking into a microphone. Basically, as scary as it gets. However, it seemed like a unique opportunity to hone our presentation skills and quite frankly, one of the only ways to really improve at public speaking. I thought back to my previous years of schooling and how inexperienced I was at presenting. I had never given a real presentation, and now I was expected to give one at the end of all my business classes. However, knowing all this, I still never ended up going to a Toastmasters meeting. I tried to watch videos and learn about public speaking, 
hoping that I could get better that way. But I quickly realized that the only way to really improve is to practice in front of a real audience. There's no way to simulate all the feelings, thoughts, and bodily responses without doing the real thing. It was, it was time to join Toastmasters. I joined Park Toastmasters and after some time gave my icebreaker speech. After that, for the first time, I truly believed that I could get better at public speaking. A thought that had never crossed my mind before. Previously, I had thought that because I was an introvert, I was never meant to speak in front of audiences. That speaking was a skill that you were born with and I simply did not have. After attending a couple of meetings and just one speech, that all changed. I hope to learn a lot from Toastmasters. I hope to learn about myself as a speaker. <coughs> um, I hope to define clear goals to accomplish. While learning from everyone at the club and developing my communication skills, I hope to provide value by by giving constructive feedback and helping others on their journey. I look forward to the experience.